Boulder. This week on The Edge, we climb to new heights at Boulder's Movement and get to meet an extraordinarily talented musician. But first, we visit our friends at Shine to walk the talk with Waylon Lewis. I'm Carrie White, and you're watching Boulder Edge TV. My name is Waylon Lewis, and I'm the founder of Elephant uh, and Walk the Talk Show. Our slogan is fun yet fundamentally serious, so we're trying to take a lot of issues that we care deeply about, whether it's politics, say GMOs or organic food, and kind of make them fun and accessible. Tonight we have Richard Freeman, probably one of the two or three most famous yoga teachers in the world. And the other person is John Diard, and he's a wellness, health doctor, been featured in the New York Times, he trains athletes. He's got some unique perspective on health and fitness and all that. Now, half the point of this is that it's meant to be a great video online talk show. But the other half of the point is to establish some sort of regular, fun community event in Boulder where people can eat and drink and children are welcome and there's good food. And, you know, the grassroots revolution, the digital revolution, really hasn't been fully taken advantage of yet. And, you know, we'll see how good we are at doing it, but we definitely get great guests. It's just my job not to um, f*** it all up. Thanks, Waylon. We had a great time. If you'd like to see a taping of Walk the Talk Show, head over to walkthetalkshow.com for details. If there's one thing Boulder has a lot of, it's places to climb. We took a tour of Movement, one of Boulder's largest climbing and fitness gyms, and learned that size isn't the only thing that sets it apart. Mike and Ann Worley Moulter were instrumental in the process of creating a building that's as energy efficient as possible. It's well insulated. There's fantastic daylighting. We also have a solar panel system on our roof that helps us put energy even back into the community and to run the building as well. We offer an opportunity for people to be together, to recreate, to work out, to meditate. We have childcare too, so we try to really bring in all sorts of community members, whether they're family or students at CU or Naropa or just regular civilians from Boulder. With the vast amount of talent in Boulder, it's not hard to believe we found another amazing musician. But did we mention she was 10 years old? Jaden Carlson gives us the scoop on being one of Boulder's youngest musicians. Take a look. Hi there, my name is Jaden Carlson. I'm almost 11, 14 days from it. And I hike, mountain bike, play guitar, sing, ski, and play soccer. So I've been playing guitar for about four and a half years now. What I like about guitar is just practically everything. Ever since I was six, I was at a Michael Franti show and I was looking up at Carl the bassist. Said to my parents, I really want to do this. And a few weeks later, we bought a guitar and took some guitar lessons. I wrote my first song when I was six and my godfather Versace, he said, why don't you start singing? And then I was like, eh, maybe not. I'm doing the Kickstarter. I'm trying to do $2,000. We're currently in the 900s right now. Actually ends on my birthday, so it would be a great surprise. I just need some support and help, and every dollar helps. Do you like the show? Do you want to contribute? Send us your ideas at ideas at boulderedgetv.com. That's all for this week on The Edge. Be sure to tune in on March 1st as we continue to bring you the best web TV show in Boulder. This is Boulder Edge TV. Mm -hmm.